Welcome back to Mental Math. We're asked to solve for x in this exponential equation. While the bases are different, one of them can be broken down in a very useful way. The key insight is to express the base 40 in terms of its prime factors, which will help us relate it to the base on the right side. We can write 40 as 8 times 5. And since 8 is 2 cubed, the prime factorization of 40 is 2 cubed times 5. Now we substitute this back into our original equation. We use the exponent rule that allows us to distribute an exponent across a product. Let's distribute the exponent x minus 1 to both the 2 cubed and the 5. This gives us 2 cubed to the power of x minus 1 times 5 to the power of x minus 1. Next, we apply the power rule for exponents, where we multiply the powers together. The exponent on our base of 2 becomes 3 times the quantity x minus 1. Distributing the 3, we get 2 to the power of 3x minus 3. Our strategy now is to gather all terms with the same base on the same side of the equation. To group the terms with base 2, We'll divide both sides by 2 to the power of 3x minus 3. This isolates the term with base 5 on the left. When dividing exponential terms with the same base, we subtract the exponents. We'll subtract the exponent in the denominator from the exponent in the numerator. Be careful with the parentheses here to ensure correct subtraction. Distributing the negative sign gives us 2x plus 1 minus 3x plus 3. Combining like terms in the exponent, we get 2 to the power of negative x plus 4. Now that the equation is simplified as much as possible, we can use logarithms to solve for x. We take the natural logarithm of both sides. Using the power rule of logarithms, the exponents come down as multipliers. We distribute the logarithmic terms on both sides. Next, we group all x terms on the left and constant terms on the right. We factor out x on the left-hand side. Using logarithm properties, natural log of 5 plus natural log of 2 is natural log of 10. And 4 times natural log of 2 is natural log of 16. Again, the sum of logs is the log of the product. Natural log of 16 plus natural log of 5 is natural log of 80. To solve for x, we divide by the natural log of 10. Finally, using the change of base formula, this is equivalent to the base 10 logarithm of 80. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this problem, please like and subscribe for more mental math challenges.